Hey you guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I'm gonna to be doing a love reading for the Zodiac sign of Leo. So today is January 24th and the prayer says, thank you for your patient and kind agape, loving towards me, dear father. Thank you for filling me with the same love and sending me out as your beloved child to a lost and loveless world. Rather than bragging about what I have or being jealous of what I don't, help me to recognize the incredible gift that love is. I want to joyfully share with everyone. Okay, in Jesus' name, amen. So let's see. Spirit guides above my ancestors and masters. My angel of prayer and life. What's going on for Leo and love? For my collective. Okay, we have photographs. So somebody, okay, is um could be masturbating to you. Okay, if this person is looking at your photograph, you look very sexy, very attractive, okay. And it's like this person wants to seduce you. Okay, this person probably wants to take you out on a date. This could be a new person, okay, or this could be someone that wants to like, you know, either engage to you, okay. But this person wants to take you out on a date, okay. Um you know, they want to flirt with you. This person could be flirting with you now, okay? But they're very attracted to you, okay? And they want to hook up with you, okay? It's like you, you know, you fire them up. Too many cards. Yeah, they're looking at your photos, missing you, nostalgic, making new memories. So this could be a past person and a new person, okay? Um, I'm seeing here we have Girl with the Snake, okay? So I'm seeing here, let's clarify this. We have Ascending. So I'm seeing here, Okay, that somebody here that was a snake, okay, could have been a girl or a, um, a male. Okay, this person, okay, was a snake. Okay, this person was a narcissist. Okay, this person had hidden attentions here. Okay, and I'm seeing here, this person is probably looking at your pictures. Okay, wanting to, you know, have sex with you. They feel like that's going to um, bring you back to them. It's like they're trapped to keep you. It's by seducing you, okay? Um, but Spirit is saying you need to enable boundaries with this person, okay? Because I'm seeing here that you are ascending. Okay, it says transcending obstacles, learning, expansion, new phase, preparing for union. So some of you guys, okay, got some people around you, okay, that want to seduce you, okay, to take you off your square. Yeah, so you have a lot of abundance coming in for you because you have a sin, you have got through obstacles, you have the healing work, right? It says keep it a positive mindset, manifest exactly what you want, gratitude, and bliss. Okay, so spirit said be grateful for the thing that you have, okay? And the more positivity you have, the more abundance you're going to have for yourself, not just in finances, but and um you know support of friend circles and family members and stuff like that okay um and ideas we have kisses see somebody wants to give you kisses here it says unconditionally loving giving and receiving affection falling in love okay and we have here i like you yeah somebody likes you we have a lot of people around you that likes you okay i want to show you affection okay and you need to be careful because it's also snakes okay so all these options is not good options you have to be careful okay because somebody is either trying to charm or use you okay either for what you have because you have abundance coming in for you okay we have love yeah so i'm seeing that somebody likes you okay they could be um want to take you out on a date okay or this could be you leo okay but i'm seeing here somebody wants to show you unconditional love okay show you affection Okay, and it's like the more that you love yourself, the more people that you're attracting towards you that's going to give you that same energy, okay? Mm -hmm. But it's always, you know, them, them few around that just want to just use you, right? And try me. We have Hammer. It says, sabotage, rebuilding, interrogation, repetitive, persistent, and working on it. So I'm seeing here, clarify Hammer. Yeah, so you're working on yourself. Self-indulgence. You focus on yourself, self-worth, time to heal, shadow work, self-appreciation, Okay. Because you can either have a habit of sabotaging relationships or getting with people that sabotage relationships, okay? Mm -hmm. We have here passion and X. Yeah, see, somebody wants to have passion with you, but I'm saying you broke that connection off. It could have been really sexual, okay? It could have worked in the past with you and them, like getting back together. Y'all could have had like crazy sex and then got back together. But I'm seeing here you're stopping that pattern, okay? you giving this person silent treatment, okay? Mm -hmm. You broke up with this person. You guys are on separation right now. But this could have been like, you know, if you wasn't in a relationship, this could have been like, um, you know, string alongs and people that, you know, that liked you. Because I see you have a lot of people that like you, Leo. Like, of course, you, you know, we have the phoenix. See, you're rising, okay? You're you're rising from the ashes, okay? You're growing. You're, um, you know, transitioning. You're transforming, okay? You're ready for a new phase, okay? Mm-hmm. It's like you're done with all of that. We have here the sword and the rose. So you find out some type of clarity and truth about somebody. Let's clarify the sword and the rose. We have here the runner. Okay. Let's see. Talking. So 
So if you can't find out some type of clarity and truth about yourself, okay, that you have fear of intimacy here, okay, and that you need to work on yourself so you could get out of that energy where you listen to your ego and you run from relationships because you had a fear of intimacy, you had a um, fear of getting too deep in love with somebody because you felt like they was going to break your heart here, okay? Mm hmm and it's like we have talking we said we have interested conversing more the awaited message arrives text call email hovering okay mm -hmm. so i'm saying you can have a lot of people that want to talk to you okay they called you emailed you okay or text you or want to meet up with you okay and it's like you ran from these people because you had a fear of intimacy because people that you probably attracted you know just probably use you for that right and you you felt like that's all they wanted from you was intimacy see spirit is saying have faith love is coming okay don't give up hope okay because i'm seeing you're giving up hope spirit is saying love is coming you're going to have a surprise invitation or meeting okay you're going to be hesitant to accept this but spirit is saying it's probably be a soulmate energy okay but use your intuition okay Let's see. Spirit guides, love and light, ancestors and masters, and the angels of the power and life. Please protect this deck from any negative energies. Please want to receive concise messages. Okay. Let's see. Tell me about Leo's connection. Okay, we have here and now. It says your true love is already part of your life. So you can feel like you already met the person that you want to be with. Okay, you love this person. Spirit is saying, but there's flat, red flags here. Okay, don't dismiss the red flags here. We're going to clarify that. We have here, fate. This is a death of partnership. So you guys were supposed to meet. Okay. We have go slow. Spirit is saying, um, take time to get to know each other. Okay, don't rush into nothing. Okay, take your time. You guys was on different pages. That's why you guys never really stayed in each other's life because you guys had different visions. Okay, either, um, you know, personally or together that you guys didn't really like, you know, agree with. We have um, stability. Okay, Spirit is in this relationship can stand the test of time. We have here you are protected. You're being divinely guided right now. And Spirit is in if you want to take this leap of faith that you're considering taking, Spirit is in take it. Okay, but you're being protected right now. Okay, but Spirit is saying, go slow. I'm seeing this could be a new person. Okay, this could be a new person. That's why Spirit is saying, get time to get to know this person. This could be a past person or a new person because uh, I'm saying this is a past person, my bad, because you guys are on different pages and you guys need to get to know each other a little better so you can understand why you guys were on different pages and you guys had different visions, right? Mm -hmm. But I'm seeing this past person. You need to release this person, okay? And Spirit is saying, whatever leap of faith that you want to take, okay? Either get in with somebody new, Spirit is saying, you can do that. Okay? Clarify um, stability. Spirit is saying, it is safe to trust in this situation. Okay? Don't think this is something false or unreal. See, we have new love. Okay. Let's see. Clarify. Don't miss what red flags is here. Don't just miss the red flags. Okay, let's see. Don't just miss the red flags, spirit guides. See, I think it's that 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 girl with the snake. It's that girl with the snake. Don't just miss the red flags about this person. This person could be coming off charming, but they, you know, they're not good for you. Clarify warning. Girl talk and hammer. See? This is somebody that sabotaged your relationship with you guys. Okay? And they want to rebuild it. Okay? You got, they could have been single. They could be spending time with friends. Okay? But Spirit is saying, this is somebody that's single now that sabotaged your relationship and they want to rebuild it. Yep. So like it's a girl with a snake. What else is going on with Leo, Spirit Guides? Of Love and Light, Ancestors and Masters. My Angel of the Power and Light. Okay. So we have here obstacle ahead. So somebody got some obstacle ahead, a brick ahead of them. 
okay, that they need to get through, okay? And it's gonna, I'm seeing here some karma and lessons that this person still needs to, to learn, okay? We have hopes and wishes. So somebody have hopes and wishes that you guys will get back with each other and somebody is being illuminated on something, okay? Divorce, see somebody's in a divorce. So somebody did something here. Yeah, and they're gonna be releasing this person. This person is toxic. Probably a karma here that they found down here that, you know, was just teaching them a lesson, okay? And I'm seeing here they have an obstacle ahead, and this person going to be thinking of you, hoping that you guys can get back together because they're going to be illuminated on all this toxicity around them. Yeah, so you left quite an impression on them, okay? And it's like they're going to embrace change, okay? Whatever karma lessons that they learn, they, they, you know, give them space, so they can learn it, okay? But just know that you are imprinted on this person's mind. You have quite an impression, okay? They know who you are to them, okay? They know who to remove from their life, okay? To release, okay? But this obstacle here is going to teach them, okay? You guys have a past life connection. This could be a term fan connection here, okay? Or well, you know this person from your past, okay? So I hope this video gave you guys a lot of clarity. If it did, don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!